try to lose a little weight. Here's my big weight loss goal. I just want to be able to have a salad and have nobody next to me go, hey, good for you. That's what I want. <laughs> it's hard to lose weight. I was trying to get something healthy. I went to Whole Foods and I was like, all right, I'm going to like look for something. This is a Whole Foods, a healthy thing. And I saw there's a box that said healthy stew. And I'm like, okay, I like stew. I like that. I'm sure I like the healthy version of it. I grab it. I go to the registers. This real snarky guy. I give him the box and he looks at me and he goes, you're going to eat that? He said that with this like condescension and this borderline contempt. And I'm like, why? Because it's unhealthy? Because it's, it's fattening? Because it's unhealthy? And he goes, no, because it's dog food. <laughs> And I looked down, and he was right. It was dog food. I didn't notice the four canines or the picture of a golden retriever with a chef hat <laughs> underneath it. And I was so embarrassed, I just left. I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't apologize or make a joke. So now he thinks that he caught a guy that eats dog food. <laughs> Honey, you won't believe who I ran into today. Another guy that eats dog food? Well, I won't tell the story if you know the ending. This fictional couple has a very bad relationship. <laughs> I've made some humiliating calls to women, but there is nothing compared to the calls I've made to pizza places at 1 a.m. Nothing. I, got, I called up one place. I was on the road. I was doing a weekend. Almost every place was closed. I called this place up, and they're like, Hi, welcome to Megabyte Pizza. And I just go, What do you guys got that's good? <laughs> I said, what do you guys got like a truck driver seeing a woman for the first time in 16 years? What do you guys got that's good? Can you describe the smell? <laughs> he goes, well, we got a really good thin crust. And I, I literally, I go, I'm going to need something a little thicker. <laughs> like, well, we got a good deep dish. And I go, how deep is it? <laughs> and I go, oh, it's real deep. And I'm like, is it cheesy? He goes, oh, it's cheesy. Like, he got into it. I'm like... I'm going to fuck this pizza guy when I see him. <laughs> he shows up. He's married. I, I grab the pizza. I go into the elevator, go up to my room. Right before the doors shut, a married couple and their seven-year-old daughter follow in after me. I'm getting off on the fourth floor. They're getting off on the sixth floor. I get off on the fourth floor, and I hear from the elevator. I hear the little girl go, I'm glad he's gone. <laughs> I wasn't doing anything. I, w I was literal. This is what she saw for, for four floors was me holding a pee. I wasn't, I didn't turn around and I was like, oogly moogly, the Easter Bunny doesn't exist. I was holding a pizza and she could sense my sad fatness like the little kid from The Shining. Like, he's gonna eat that pizza over the toilet while crying. Food goes in his mouth, food goes out his butt. Das taff, das taff. That's sad and fat backwards, in case you haven't seen the movie. It's a great movie. Fuck that little girl.